Hello, everybody. Uh, Mr. Mrs. and Miss, how are you doing today? Hope you guys are doing good. So I don't know if you guys have seen, if you watched uh, our short video. The last short video we had, uh, I told you about something new that we were blinging, that we are about to get started on. So uh, we are getting started on blinging out liquor bottles, okay? So liquor bottles, this is, I am Marca Prosecco, sparkling wine. This is sparkling wine. This is 11% alcohol volume. And we are gonna be blinging this out. Like I said, those of you, if you didn't watch the short videos, then I showed this blue, pretty blue glitter. It's a pretty blue, okay? So I'm gonna be doing that. It's not exact. Like my husband was saying, it's not exact, but hey, this is blue and this is blue. Okay, so we're gonna we're gonna do it, you know, and we'll be blinging out different bottles like, excuse me, Don Julio. I want to do um, what else? Tequila, you know, everything, everything, vodka, wine, beer. For the, you know, those of you that don't drink hard liquor, you know, people like wine and stuff. So we'll be blinging these out all right so hang tight i'm gonna go um we got this mod podge that i'm working with too okay so you need your glitter and this is the jumbo glitter okay mod podge you can th get this from amazon from you know any kind of craft place michael's mod podge and what this is is a glue sealer and finish Blue sealer and finish. So you want to put a few coats on here. Okay. So I'm going to be uh, open these up in the meantime. And I'll see you guys in a minute. Okay, you guys. So I'm back. So also you want to get some brushes. Pick up some brushes if you want to get into this. Into blinging out liquor bottles. Now mine is full and I was going to do this yesterday with you guys but I did somebody's house you know we do house so for those of you that are new we do house cleaning uh, we have a catering business house cleaning business and jewelry business okay so besides that we love you know uh, organizing the baskets getting the baskets ready and now we're going to be blinking out liquor bottles and a wine glass you know, so I'm going to get a wine glass to go with this. That'll be a, another video, but this will be also, um, it will come with a wine glass. And that wine glass will have the same color glitter, okay? So, I'm going to get started. Show you guys what I have. So, before you get started, you want to make sure you have some alcohol, rubbing alcohol, and you want to clean the glass part of the bottle. Make sure it's all clean, okay? So I'm gonna do that right now. How are you all doing? I haven't been on here in a while, but I did do that short video um, just to let you guys know, you know, what we're getting into, okay? So this, I've been thinking about this. This is what I've been thinking about and I've been talking to you guys about it about, oh, I got something new that I want to do in my, you know, downtime from the baskets and everything. So I feel like it's a good thing to get into. And I don't know about where you guys live, but like I said before, folks out here, they love to drink. And ever since the pandemic, everybody drinking and partying and, you know, just enjoying life. Like you, you got to enjoy life, you know. So let me talk to you guys for a minute while I let that alcohol dry. So I feel like this is a this would be a good thing to get into, you know. Um, like I said, it's been on my mind for a while. 
and me and my husband been talking about it. So uh, I said, why not? You know, go ahead and do it. And um, I just, I, I know that I can really make it pop. You know, I love to design things, interior design. That's my background. That's where I come from. Um, and, you know, I did, I went to school for that. I went to college for that. But I should have, I feel like I, I always think about how I should have pursued what I went to school for, you know, interior design. So, and that's where all this decorating come from, you know, designing baskets, designing you know, now I want to do the bottles, designing um, jewelry, you know, so that's where everything comes from. It stems from me going to school for interior design, which, you know, I love to design homes and stuff too. You know, we're about to design our home. We've been doing things, you know, here and there to, you know, get it together and stuff because we have, we live in a, you know, we've been here almost two years, so... We're getting it together slowly, you know, and once it's fully together, like I want to show you guys the lounge, excuse me. So once we get that sports lounge together, uh, I'll show you guys everything, all the details and stuff. You guys want me to show you something? Now, before I get started on the bottle, this is a picture that we're going to be hanging up. This is one of the pictures. We're going to be hanging up a lot of sports pictures, but... It's going to be sports, like sports theme and sexy, you know? So we got this. We got that. Y'all tell me how y'all like that. We're going to be hanging that up. We got to get a frame for it. And this will go out in the lounge that we have. Okay. So this is one thing that we have so far. I got some other things picked out. Like I told y'all before, I'm a... Amazon Fanatic, Amazon Timu, and uh, what else? I'll be on all kind of apps, you know? So this is one picture that I got. We purchased not too long ago. So like I said, we will slowly get everything together and we'll show you guys. Once we get it together, we're gonna show you guys, okay? So I'm gonna get started with this. This is all dry, okay. So you wanna purchase your uh, paint brushes, purchase some brushes, okay. You also wanna purchase Mod Podge. Like I said, Amazon, Dollar Tree even has it. Amazon, Dollar Tree, you can get this from Michaels, Joann's, you know, uh, maybe Hobby Lobby for those of you that have them. Um, so you can purchase this Mod Podge uh, glue sealer and finish from all those type of arts and craft stores and then pick you up some glitter Now you want to definitely have the glitter to match, you know, whichever drink it is Whatever um, paper, you know label and everything is in that drink And then you also want to make sure You have a piece of paper, you know construction paper. This is lined paper um, Just to catch the glitter because I'm saving my glitter, honey. I'm putting it back in here, okay? And then I have this little styrofoam bowl. Uh, and so I'm gonna, right now I'm gonna add my glue in the bowl. Just like this. Okay. So I've been seeing folks work and everything, um, baskets lately, um, where people shopped at and stuff. So, um, you know, I feel like you guys been into some really nice stuff this summer. And the things that people are purchasing, they're, they're really nice. So, okay, I'm gonna start it off with this big brush, okay? Cause this is a big bottle. And then you want to use a smaller brush for the small little, we'll be doing some little shot glasses too. And maybe bling the shot glasses out. I mean, the shot uh, bottles. I'm sorry, you guys. The liquor shot bottles, you want to use a smaller um, brush. But we're going to be blinging the shot glasses out too to match the shot bottles, okay? All right, so 
you want to get started and I'm going to add, you want to open your, your uh, glitter, have your glitter open right away because this Mod Podge, I learned from other people, um, it dries quickly. So you want to get that, you want to, you know, brush that onto your bottle just like so. And you want to make sure that some people, you know, they cover up the label and stuff, but I'm not doing that because, you know, it's, it's going to fall off of that label anyway, you know, so I'm not doing that. Okay, so just make sure you do one area at a time. You don't want to do too much of an area. And you definitely want to go over the whole bottle, you know, a few times. Put a few coats on there, okay? So then I'm going to sprinkle the gl glitter. Sprinkle that all over that area. Okay. And then you want to, you know, keep going with another area. And then once you um, have the whole bottle completed, you want to let it dry for an hour, one hour, okay? Let it dry for one hour. And then you want to go over, go over it with the Mod Podge and glitter for a second coat, okay? So that's how you do it. Okay, so you guys let me know what else you have getting in have gotten into, you know, lately. If you into something uh new besides the baskets, you basket makers, if you are into something new, or those of you that are, you know, if you have another craft going on, let me know what that is. Cause I'm always interested in things that people have going on. Okay, so then you want to add more glitter to that area. Oh, you guys, man. This is coming out, it's coming out. I like that bling. Okay, and then you wanna make sure you get the bottom part. Not underneath, but you know, just go to the very bottom and get that part. And I follow um, a few people that, you know, do this, like Life is a Whole Vibe. That's the name of her channel. She she does a great job. Like she has a lot of nice work and stuff. So I love her channel. Okay. Now you want to add more glitter to those areas that you just put the glue.
Man, you guys. I'm loving it. This is another, I found another craft. Well, not actual craft, but you know, another uh, thing under our belt for, for our business. So that's what I, um, I'm, I'm happy about it. Like I said, it, it catches my eye when I see other people do it. And it looks good. And people love when things look good, you know. Because it makes them feel good. You know what I mean? And me and my husband, we love making people feel good about themselves. You know, sell, sell them jewelry and everything that they like. Okay? So, we don't have no problem with that. I put too much at that time. Okay. So, it got on my hand too. All right. So, I'm going to let this dry for one hour. And this is how it's looking right now, you guys. You let me know if that blue, you know, looks good with the label. Because I know the actual glitter is a, you know, brighter blue. The label is a baby blue. So I feel like the glitter just brings it out, you know. So you guys let me know what you think. And I'll see you in one hour. I'll be back. Well, I'm going to pause it so you guys will see it. You'll see it in a minute. Hey, you guys. Okay, so it's been one hour right now. So we're going to get back to it. All right. So let me. Okay, so. Got the glue right here. I don't know if I told you guys, but you also want to have a brush. Like to scrape off where the, um, you know, if the glitter is on the, um, you know, the label. Then you also want to brush that off too okay so that's all i want to tell you now i'm gonna get back to it second coat it's been like probably a little over an hour i was running my mouth on the phone y'all And you just want to, this second coat, you just want to dab like that. You know, you don't have to put a whole lot because you just want to basically um, fill in the gaps of wherever, you know. So just to make it look full. So I'm just dabbing it. And then what I think I'll also do is get another sealer. There's this uh, clear sealer. I got to figure out what kind that is. I mean, what's the name of it and stuff. Probably on Amazon I can get that. So right now, it's pretty much full, but I do see some gaps. So where the glitter is not in that area. So I definitely want to get those areas and make sure it's full. So what you guys got going on, let me know. Is it nice where you are? What where um what state do you live in and stuff let me know we've been having a lot of wind you know they keep saying oh it's nice 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 but the bay area is nice but it's windy so maybe further out like you know east bay and everything down that way down the highway is it's more hotter but we don't have that out here close to the coast it is not all that spectacular, like real hot. Okay, so 
And I know I want to get right there close to the label. There, there is none right there. Let me see. Okay, yeah, this jumbo, you really don't have to put two coats. I feel like it's pretty much enough because this, you know, the glitter is so uh, much bigger jumbo. I think that that's for that, um, that's for the smaller glitter to where you have to put a full coat because what I'm, what I'm looking at right now is, it's pretty much covered. By the glitter being larger. Okay, so let me add some more. And I did add some more glitter, you guys, back into the container. loving the look y'all i'm loving the look i'm loving this this color glitter it just stands out okay so that's pretty much it for the glitter like i said i think you know there's a sealer to wear like after this second time um you put on top and it's it's clear you know it's not the my podge so i definitely want to um figure out which one that is and i'm going to purchase it but that is going to be it you guys i'm not going to keep you much longer I hope you like it. Let me know what you guys think of our addition to our uh, Boss Pieces creations, our jewelry line and baskets. I definitely want to know. Okay. So I will definitely be doing the next video of the glass with you guys. Okay, so let me tell you guys, thank you. Thank you for, for watching today. And I will see you guys soon. I hope you like it. <laughs> I guess you guys say this girl is doing, always doing something different. Okay, so, hey, I'm into it. I am definitely into it. But I will talk to you guys soon. I'll bling out the glass with you on the next video and maybe some Patron or whatever. I'm going to get whatever other drink and bling that out. But I will talk to you guys soon. Thank you for subscribing. Please share. Please like the video and comment and all of the above. Thank you so much for watching and have a good one. Take care.